Okay guys, so we are here at the uh, job site and my crew and we put uh, new wood and that's Javier, my kababayan and he's the boss, the contractor, Robert Ponsalan Construction and so what you can see, those two in the middle, those two, is the old one and this is the new redwood that we put in because that's the, as per owner requested so pretty much uh, what we did here is we cut this one because they used to be attached to the old wood. So in order to us to run a new one, we cut out uh, like that two inches to the edges. And then up here you're gonna adding those brackets, the HU410. No, I think this is a different uh, bracket, no? This is a, uh, hold on now, I think uh, this is a uh, HU210. That's the one that goes over there, the sample uh, two by eight, 10. But the, the wood is a red wood, so it's a little bit tight, but it's okay. It's tight, it's better. It's gonna shrink over time. But uh, let me show you outside. And Yo, you're gonna bring the all the tools, huh? huh? Hold on, let me talk to you later. So what you can see, what we did here is uh, it's a bunch of uh, dry rot on uh, cantilever. Those, uh, those are two wood that I mentioned to you, the video that I show you inside. Those basically buried from, from the edge of the top, double top plate, it's 4 feet and the stick out is 24 so what I would suggest is um, uh, adding a new wood to the existing and touch to the parallel wood which is the, that way and then that's a basically as a shoring and it's all brand new wood that's what the owner requested so what um, what well, the progress here is Jason is still working with the mud seal and this is dry rot already too and then uh, maybe you put a wood here so you're gonna put another wood and in order to keep the wood straight to the existing one I asked my brother adding a wood at the same time and then uh, yeah there's a lot of dry rot here that uh, we have to replace all the dry rot, so basically this is a new one. And uh, they're gonna add more wood over here. Eight and a half. So pretty much, uh, it was about the uh, high-end job that we did here. And then I know that the owner is gonna be happy after we replace those uh, wood on it so let me explain it to you up about that so what basically what we do here is um, those are new redwood so you can see those all new redwood so we cut out the dry rot part and then this is the uh, existing last plastering so pretty much above this uh, I start the two by four it's already has been repaired and then we just kind of get this thing going um all the things that we need to take care of it so javier we cut out with the angle as well once we put the new water table we're gonna sit wherever i want and then um yeah so there's a lot of progress my crew they're working hard it made those friday today and then let me show you what the, basically what are we gonna repair this one so if you can see this is the dry rot that we talked about to you before I mentioned to you that so basically my my crew what they did is I mentioned them to them cut it over here and set the new one and once the new one is already in place the repair we're adding another wood all the way across from here from here to the end of the th double top plate but basically, this is a single top plate it's not a double top plate i don't know why the back in all the use of single one but anyway so what my crew do it is if you see the other side is all brand new on the front but inside it's cut out here we're just adding a new one and we we sister a new one which is a brand new all the way on the front so basically this new existing is screw the SDS after that. It's like a zigzag. And 
Yeah, so life is good for the old contractor and it's all about work and then see you guys later and you guys have a great weekend. Today is May 26th. See you guys next video. Bye.